deputies with the Indian River County Sheriff's Office out early trying to clear the area and make room for the special U.S. Navy bomb unit to clear that torpedo out of here. Fire in the hole, fire in the hole, fire in the hole. Well, it was kind of a little bit of a letdown. It was, we were looking for a little bit bigger boom, but I'm glad the boom was out there and not down, you know, in front of the house here. Now, this is what we're talking about. It's a World War II torpedo that was discovered Monday by a crew excavating at a housing construction site here along the ocean. Now, getting rid of this is a bit of an ordeal. We're off the dune line by about 50 to 75 feet uh, is where it was located, so we had to uh, cut an opening in the dune line and it had to be drug uh, mechanically off the, off the site and down to the water's edge. In the meantime, though, the area was blocked off and the beach closed 800 feet north and 800 feet south. Ran some errands and my wife uh, ended up with all the animals uh, in her car, so that was good because I talked to her and I heard cats meowing like crazy and dogs howling, and so I got to go off and do fun stuff. Why uh, do, you, do you spot bees in this area? Uh, you know, back in World War II, this was a tra training facility. Uh, and this is where they actually tested all of those uh, Tiny Tim uh, torpedoes. Uh, they dropped them out of airplanes and uh, evaluated their effectiveness against the enemies. So this is the training grounds for them. So they're still here. I hear there are more out there. <laughs> what do you think about that? Yeah, I think these guys are going to be able to find them and do a good job taking care of them. So I'm not worried at all. Not one bit.